Hey, it's Ed here. It's Thursday night, about 7 o'clock, just on my way to a meeting, and thought I'd shoot a quick video for you guys. I'm thinking lately about tension, and tension in our lives, and ultimately, like, stress in our lives, and experienced a little bit of that lately, too, as well, as, uh, as you go through growth, and things happen, and it's inevitable that it's going to show up. I was thinking of like, where does where does this stuff come from? Why do we have it? Now, from that, I started thinking about well, maybe it probably comes from our past experiences, and our past experiences, as we are experiencing them again, we are thinking that the outcome is potentially going to be the same, and through that we project into the future what we think is going to come. Like, so, the stress and the tension that comes in our lives is the pull between our past and our future that we think is going to happen based on what we experienced before. Now, what that seems to happen in my life is that that robs me of the experience of living in the moment and the moment and the present is it's such a gift and to live in that tension and in that stress that distracts us from the gift of the moment we have is something that we should just let go so how how are you dealing with those kinds of things in your lives? What kind of tensions are you having lately? And when I, when I have tensions and stress and things, I've had, the best thing for me to do is to write them down. To get them out of my head, get them onto a piece of paper, into a journal, into a book. Where I can release myself of them. And be able to go back to them later. Analyze them, take a look at them and see what they mean in my life. So, that's about all I have to say today. Thanks for taking the time to listen. Leave your comments below. If you're on my blog or on YouTube, leave your comments. Or on Facebook. And I look forward to hearing from you. Hope you're having a wonderful day. And look forward to talking to you again soon. God bless you. Take care.